winning. Winning HR is not always an easy thing, but it is absolutely something doable. And if you're trying to figure out how to get ahead, if you're trying to figure out what's going on, if you're trying to figure out how can I get the most out of everything that's coming my way, or if you've never even thought about it, now's the time to start, right? <clears throat> One of the things that you can do to get yourself ahead in HR is applying your talents to the fullest. Now, I'm not talking about your passion. I'm actually talking about your talents, the things that you're good at, right? So for me, I am a natural problem solver. I'm really good at it. And I have this very unique, uncanny mechanical ability that I can literally take something apart, and literally put it all back together. And oddly, the thing still works. Like you remember those, um, those things in school where they have a, they, they take a shape of a box or a shape of something and they would deconstruct it and it would be flat. And you had to take a look at that configuration and figure out what the end result was going to be. And it would give you a couple of different options. I can nail those things every single time. That's my mind. That's my mechanical ability. Those are things that I'm good at. Those are my gifts. If you're, if you focus in on your gifts and you focus in on utilizing and applying your talents to your fullest capability, mine being my number one really is being a problem solver. I can come up with a ton of solutions for one specific issue then you will catapult yourself to the next level, literally, because people are going to dial in on the things that you're good at because you're working it and you're exercising those the most. Now, if you're trying to build a career based off of your weaknesses, you're going to have a long road to hoe. But if you want to win, if you want to start getting ahead, literally dial in at what you're good at and really exercise that to the fullest of your potential and your possibility. Cause I don't like the word potential. <laughs> if you've written my book, you'll know why. Anyway, listen, if you want to know more about this, we're coming to your town. Suzanne Lucas, known as the evil HR lady. We are coming to your town and myself, and we're going to be in Baltimore. We're going to be in Dallas and we're going to be in Provo. You'll be able to earn recertification credits. This session is going to sell out. In addition to that, we're also going to do a really awesome active shooter training in Provo that will be broadcast to all of attendees who are in Baltimore and Dallas. So if you want to know more, go ahead, click the link below, get yourself your seat. It's going to sell out. We are hitting the road for one week in July and can't wait to see you guys there.